Hi, it's me, Betty B, and I wanted to share a couple of monochromatic cards with you today. I think monochromatic, meaning one color, cards are some of the most beautiful cards that are on the market and that we can make. And these are two that I have made for my sisters-in-law who have birthdays one day, one, one day and one the next. So, I wanted to share with you how to do this, and actually I made a whole video that didn't record, so I'm going to be showing them to you completed this time, and I promise I'll come back soon and show you, um, you know, how I put them together on another day and how to um, show a, a whole new look. But anyway, these, um, I wanted you to see how pretty they are in, in colors other than just white. Um, this one is done in cream color, and this one is done in white. So, this one is, an, they're both an A2 size card, which means four and a quarter by five and a half, and they have layers, and that's what really makes monochromatic cards so gorgeous, is that they have lots of layers and te textures. And this one starts off with a plain base, and then I have run the next layer through the embossing machine, which is the cuddle bug, and that's what gives it this background. And then this piece that's on the top of it here was also run through it with a die cutter, and that's what gives it this scalloped piece here. Um, under here you're going to notice a beautiful piece of gorgeous lace. And since I only need five and a half or six inches of lace that's here, I can look for some fabulous trims in my um, local Joann's or, or uh, Hancock or whatever sewing store you might have around and be able to get some gorgeous trims. And uh, sometimes in the remnant bin you can find something that's really extraordinary. Um, I have used a double tape to go across, a double sided tape to hold it down just across the top and then added a satin ribbon and that's attached behind this layer which is then added with some adhesive foam to give it a dimensional layer. Then this layer is turned on a diamond shape so that it accommodates this beautiful heart which was made by a friend of mine on an embroidery machine. Now I've added this to this element right here with a removable adhesive. Isn't that fun? So that my sister-in-law can take this off of here and she could wear it on her shirt if she wanted to. She might be able to add it to her scripture bag or some other place that was real special to her if she'd like. I've used a special to a dear sister tag and then a double bow and a button and some pearl trims and these were added with a hot glue gun here. And then with the black um, element, uh, I mean the sentiment inside, that just kind of completes the clean, clean look um, with this card. And this one with the cream color, again, it's the exact same type of a construction with the uh, embossed background. This time it's a different one. And back there with some leaves and some things that are going to match this element. I turned this element on the square to accommodate the circle. Oh, something's going on in the kitchen. And I used three different tr layers of this trim because it was a narrow trim. And I stacked it, added some satin trim across there, another double bow, and then used the pearls here on this tag, which I trim uh, was able to run across my finger and just uh, curved it a little bit there. And then for the ink, I used a nice warm brown ink and a chocolate colored ink for my sentiment on the inside so that it goes nicely with this uh, cream colored cardstock. And this piece and this piece are both done with that removable adhesive which makes it such a nice element there. And even though it's totally monochromatic, meaning the, uh, all the colors are the same, I love this tiny little pop of color which gives them something real special. It's just that special surprise. Neither one of these have real thick um, embellishments, you know, stacks and stacks and stacks. That way they can go in the mail today. So thanks for stopping by. This is Betty B with Betty B Designs and I'll be back again real soon with some more fun things to do. Bye-bye now.